Along with the RF transmitter receiver module, we shall also need an encoder and a decoder IC. The encoder IC that we shall use is an HT12V and the decoder IC is HT12D. Both of them are an 18 pin ICs and are easily available in the market. Now let us look at the pin configuration for both of them. Here I have an HT12V IC with me. I have also drawn the pin configuration for the same. So let us have a look at the pin configurations. Here we have A0 to A7 pins. These pins we shall not be using in our setup and they shall be just left open. Here we have a ground and here we have VCC. VCC shall be used to give the power supply. Now let's uh, start with. The next pin is output pin. This pin shall be connected to the data pin of the transmitter. We shall see it in the circuit diagram. Here if we have a look, this pin was connected to the data pin of our transmitter of the transmitter module. The next two pins are oscillator pins. The HT12A IC has an inbuilt built oscillator and we just need to connect an external resistor between these two pins. So in our setup we shall connect a 750K ohm resistor between these two pins. The other pin is the uh, transmission enable pin. We shall ground this pin in our setup. And the other pins are AD0, AD1, AD2 and AD3. We shall connect the push buttons here. Pushing these buttons here shall shall affect the corresponding uh, uh, LEDs on the receiver section. Here we can see that we have uh, we need to connect this to the push buttons.